First semester cost of air. Hello everyone, if you are new here, my name is Devraj and I am a first year computer science student from Nepal. And in this video, I am going to share my experience as a first semester student of BSCCSIT. It feels just like yesterday when I stepped into my college for the orientation of this course and that was four months ago and I feel it went very fast, really fast. Okay, so let's start with the first month. So on the very first week, we went to an introductory hike organized by our college to Marvel Dana in Godavari. It was not just for like enjoying the scenic beauty of the place but also to like know each other because we are going to spend the next four years in the same classroom. So we really needed to break that wall of awkwardness that always comes with meeting new people. <laughs> In that day, we engaged in some collaborative activities like playing our treasure hunt game and stuff like that and that really helped to break that wall as I said before. And as classes progressed, I along with my friends embraced each and every opportunity that came with it. At the end of February, I went to my first ever hackathon with my four friends and that was a really cool experience for me. The hackathon was organized by Security Val in collaboration with Skill Labs and as freshers, we didn't possess any extensive knowledge knowledge of building something from scratch. So at the end of the hackathon we presented our idea but it was not as flawless as we had hoped. The experience was all that mattered to us. We didn't win the main prize obviously but <laughs> we did go on to win one of the side contests that was held the same day. You were wondering the same thing. And look at that beautiful photo. So Beyond any awards, as I said before, the thrill of stepping into that new horizon was itself a win for us. And I guess the experience will last with me as well as my friends for like a very long time. We were the youngest team in that hackathon. I guess the next youngest team above us was from 5th or 6th semester. So this experience will be a reminder of the importance of pushing boundaries, embracing challenges and also venturing into an uncharted territory. And just after the hackathon, there was yet another new experience that was awaiting us and that was halt price i didn't know much about that program or that competition as a whole and i was really excited to know about it so i participated in that competition with my team panch pokhari this was the team and theme of the halt price that i participated in was to redesign the fashion industry and we presented our idea of ecoverse if anybody wants to know about it i can make a video about that but i won't include that idea in this video we didn't win the main prize we didn't even come close to the price. Uh, we thought our idea was good but again it was not flawlessly presented and again the experience is all that matters. I guess th I am saying this a lot in this video but yeah it matters. As a part of the whole prize we also went to a hike to Pilot Baba in Bhaktapur this time and we did a waste disposal campaign. You can watch the vlog of that day. This whole prize was one of the foundation for me to beat my stage fright too. I have made a video on that too so you can check it out. I made a lot of video. And now you might be asking, Devras, didn't you study at all this semester? Because since the start of the video, I've just been explaining about my experiences outside of the studies. So let's talk about the studies for a moment. <laughs> In the first sem, we have five subjects. This is the list. And out of all these, at first, I found digital logic to be the most difficult one. As time progressed, I practiced from YouTube. Our teacher taught us well, but I found an online source that taught even better, I guess. It's a channel called Neso Academy. It's an Indian channel, I guess. And like it teaches you from the basics to anything that you need to learn about like a broad range of topics related to IT and I learned 
digital logic from that and now it's easier for me in the last four months i've given three exams i've just completed a practical exam right now and our board exam starts from next week so there are a lot of exams and this is a good thing that i found about the semester type course because the exams keep on coming and you have no choice other than to study so when the board exams come you feel you are confident enough to write of course you have to revise all of the stuff but it becomes easier since you have been studying the whole semester and i've been preparing for that board exam also so i'm not only making videos so let's go back to experiences <laughs> there isn't much to talk about there were small programs like the holy program that we had and other small stuffs uh, now the next big thing is around the same time i also started this youtube channel to like document my journey through studying and personal development i have posted almost 18 to 20 videos including shorts in this channel till now and like i have done videos like this and i think it has been a documentation of my life this whole semester so you you can head over to the channel to watch the videos that i've posted about my personal growth and the studies and other things uh, now the verdict so should you study csit this might be a question for you right but before that let's see what my friends have to say about their experiences as csit students yes i am sir माउंट केटू रगरमाथा के नपढाइर <laughs> 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 साइड नोट में छू हम समृद्धि कलेज को स्किल लैब को एम्बेसडर है कलेज एम्बेसडर होना खतरी मैं हो ठूल मैं तेरह उसे कुरो सही हो समृद्धि कलेज आ सुरू में भेटने मानी यही हो मात्र हो तिम्रो टेन को बारे में भन्दा नि एक एक्सिस नेपाल छ फेसबुकमा छ अनि इन्स्टाग्राम मान्छौ मी डिस्कर्ड मान्छौ के हो भन्दै न यो चाहिँ रोबोटिक साइन्स हो कि सानसान बच्चा हो रोबोटिक साइन्स के हो भने सिकाउँछ है अल द बेस्ट भयो सानसान बच्चा हामीलाई सिकाउन यार हामीलाई नि आउँदैन रोनिस भन्छौ यता आउने यार कहाँ भाग यार तिमी के छ यार भन न कस्तो भयो फर्स्ट सेमिस्टरको एक्सपीरियन्स मैले भनेको अब जस्तो नयाँ मान्छे सिएसआइटी पढ्छु भन्दैछ भने उसलाई कतिको सजेस्ट गर्छु सिएसआइटी के छ यार कस्तो थियो कस्तो एक्सपिरियन्स थियो ब्रो होइन होइन फर्स्ट सेमिस्टरको एक्सपिरियन्स भन न टोटल एज अ होल आज मात्रै होइन
So as you can see there are a lot of contrasting views. This was just a sample size of 20 or less than 20 students. Uh, if you go on social media ask should I study CSID, should I study BCA, should I go in generic? There will be a lot of contrasting views and, and the only thing that does is confuse you a lot. I recommend you to research by yourself, see the syllabus of each and every course that you have in your choice and find the things that you are interested in. Maybe you don't want to do engineering, maybe you do want are in front of your name who knows that all depends on you but if you want to do engineering there is no one stopping you right instead of asking you online should i study basis or you can take the views but at the end the decision depends upon you and the decision should be made according to what you want to do right what you are interested in learning the courses are not that different but the syllabus is passed in engineering there are also so many students that take upon this IT field or the courses related to this just because they have heard that there is a great scope in IT and all that. But believe me, once you join this course and if you are really not interested just because of the scope you are joining this course, six months will always feel like a year. It will feel like a long time because at the first place you are not interested. So I recommend do what interests you and don't just get into this field because of the scope and everything and yeah choose a path that really ignites a fire in you to do something so that was my opinion if you want to take it take it this is it for today and i'll see you in the next video till then peace out